Oh, apparently Chris Redfield is a Havel monster. Who would have thought it? And he's just as dumb. Brilliant. Way to go. I chip okay, then why did I expect that to stagger you? <laughs> I'm stupid. I'm bloody one-handing a normal straight sword. Do you like fighting on the stairs? What kind of alien being are you? Nobody likes fighting on the stairs. Why do you why are we fighting up here for that matter? So you can try and abuse the fact your great sword has easier reach? For shame! Oh, I got you. Oh, it staggered you too. You better be lying a little bit, my good man. Oh, that was stupid of me. I don't know what I was going for there. Can you please stop? I'm going to punish the fuck out of you. You're a Havel monster who brought me up to a platform to just swing your greatsword around. I take offense. That was stupid of me. Are you seriously healing? Are you, are you serious? Oh my goodness. I thought fucking Capcom did enough to sully Resident Evil's name. Apparently no, Chris Redfield's fucking doing the job for them as well. Get the fuck out of here. There's a difference between backstab fishing and punishing the shit out of somebody for being a massive bitch. You are the latter. I don't know how you didn't bloody, you know, get staggered like you did last time. And you're fat rolling. You're fat rolling? You may want to, yep, just, uh... <laughs> do exactly what I wanted you to. You can't fat roll. When people see the fat roll, they can just bump uglies up against the front of you till you roll away and then immediate backstab. And if you didn't know that, you damn well better do now. Oh. oh. Is this a dual... Oh, okay then, we've we've got Rain versus Alon. Uh, God damn it, I knew that attack was there. I've used the fucking thing myself. How do I know cap? Why am I standing still up against you? God damn, I'm bad at this. There you go, now... Fucking get you with one of those? Maybe not. Please don't go for a backstab. That will hurt. That will hurt more than bloody waterboarding. Please. Oh, save my own bloody life. Now you're gonna go for a turnaround. Having none of that shit. Not here. Not now. Not ever. Fucking Neverland. Peter Pan. Oh, think of. How did that not get me? I'm really thankful it didn't. But how didn't it? Oh, that was stupid. I make my stamina management about as good as the fucking monetary management in Canada. Oh, oh backstab. That was really clever of you. You're a bastard. I'm gonna get that, I'm sorry. But I'm not trying to backstab fish, but bloody hell. Any damage I try to put out with my bloody strong weapon fucking misses every time. You're a very, very good opponent. No, having none of it. Fuck it in, you big goddamn meanie. I do oh my god, that's not good. Not a good damage trade off. Oh god. It's apparently the ninja is better than the warrior. Oh god. I'm really surprised that couldn't get me. This is fucking hell. Oh. <laughs> That's just so little damage. Really need it to do more. Oh, God, save my life again. Well, we're both one hit from death. If you could seppuku the shit out of yourself, that would have been lovely. Instead, you can backstep into your own demise. Wow, that duel just happened. Dear Fitesh, you're fucking awesome. Thank you for that. That was a duel made in heaven. Oh, and a rude toot toot to you too, my good man. Learn enough about that dancing around the fact and actually get to fighting. Why are you blood red and horrible? Why? Why are you blood red and horrible? I'm sorry for our one spamming you there. I know it's not a terrible thing. I do remember you actually now after seeing that goddamn cancel. That is very rare. Gotcha! You should not. Ow. I was about to say that trade off was worth it, but you know what? No, you've got the goddamn hex crossbow. I thought it was just a normal crossbow. That fucked me right in the mouth. Ooch! God damn the range of that. Did you. That was slow. Nope. Well, that's clever of you, isn't it? Fucking clever bastard. Isn't he clever? Give him a goddamn medal. Got you again. And I get... Are you lagging? I feel like I'm taking advantage of you at some point there. I did... That's not what I would have expected at all. I feel bad not backstabbing you now. I <laughs> should have gone for that. I've never seen that spell being used in PvP before. I've seen it. I know it exists. I know what it does. It's just not something that ever really seemed whoops, worth it in PvP. Why am I just rolling at you consistently? Bloody moron! You're gonna do that every time. What do you expect me to? You, that would be smart if the wind up for the attacks wasn't, you know, so long overall all the time. Sorry for the R1 spam. I think I cut myself off earlier when I was apologising for that. What on God's green earth? I know R1 spam isn't a deadly horrible thing. It's part of the move set and it's supposed to be used properly. But it's, I always feel slightly dirty doing it because it's so bloody effortless. That, my good man, was the worst decision you made. I'm hitting you in the face and your idea was to do something where you won't immediately hit me. I mean, come on. I have eyes. The animation for that spell is different to, you know, slapping me in the face with a spear. Good game though, man. That was really fun. I'm fighting somebody with a white ring on. And I think you're using a Lon's... Yes, you are. You are using that blade. 
How dare you use that without actually wielding the armor? Wait, wielding the armor. Wearing the armor. You wield a weapon, you wear armor. Bloody difference. Why am I so thick today? And not, you know, beautiful woman, nice meat on the bones thick. I mean, dumb as fucking mud thick. <laughs> Got you again. I mean, I've done that like three times now. How are you not adapting to it? Oh, I would have loved to have punished you for doing that. You know, I understand that the second move there is the thing that deals the more damage and usually catches people out more. So, I was expecting you'd fall up that. Kind of weird that you didn't. Gonna go for a parry? I assume that's why the shield's there. No, maybe not. Ooh, why did that miss? Ooh, why did I do that? I would've hit him. That would've been a trade I would've gotten the better of. Bastard. I literally just saved my life. What if for the backstab fish, but it was either that or get slapped by a katana. Can't really say I'm all for that one. Sorry. Gotcha. Silly wee bastard. Please. Oh my god. It's a good thing you're not lagging. Because the pretty much perfect connection right now is what, damn it, is what's saving me. If only that backstab just saved me from being parried and doomed. Gotcha. Oh, that would have been the end here. Come here. Oh, you haven't got 100% block, have you? Gonna have to kill you eventually. Now I need to be worried because your shield is still out and you can still parry me. I need to bait that out so I feel safe. Go on. Oh, no, no, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, you fucking rolling evasive circle monkey. Come here. Well, oh dear. Oh my god, that got me. Oh dear. Well, that was a mistake. That wasn't, though. You wasting all your stamina. That was the mistake. You managed to close the gap, and then you just threw that out the window. Good game, though, man. Fucking hell, I'm stupid. Hello, Unleash the Wolf. Second time's around. Let's see how this goes for the both of us. Whatever you do, don't do that and make yourself feel silly in the morning. Have one of those. Oh, that damage trade-off was worth it. I say that. Oh, really? I was really expecting that to pay off for me. You bastard. That didn't get you either. Bloody hell. I'm so used to fighting with lag on the opponent that most hits that shouldn't hit do hit that it's weird when what should happen actually happens. Ow. That demonstrator wasn't worth it at all. I hope I made sense when I just rambled on there. The translation, if you bloody didn't, it usually lags and I'm used to the bullshit. It's good the bullshit's gone, but it's weird that it's, well, gone. You can just let me hit you with this. You seem to be just letting me hit you with this. I feel bad having- Oh my- That did not get me. You saw it, I was several feet to the left of that. Stop bloody doing- How does that not get you through a roll? Ooh, I like fighting you. You're very versatile. I like all the things you swap out. It's very fun to- I'm serious, by the way. It's very fun to fight against. Now you got a crossbow as well. I mean, you got everything. You're really varied. Do a roll. Ah, fuck, if that tracked more. Which it doesn't, by the way. It doesn't bloody all. Ooh, that was your downfall. It always sucks when somebody taking a risk for the right reasons ends up losing because of it, but that's the way it works, I'm afraid. I'm really surprised I haven't been parried so far, by the way. Infinitely grateful. Thank you, Dark Souls gods. A shield and a crossbow? I've got news for you, Felter. There's, there's something that does both of that in one. You should consider using it. All you got to do is kill a man on a bloody chariot. It's rather easy. So easy, in fact. Ow. But uh, the chariot lives longer than the bloody man. What the- Your animation barely even started up and it hit me. I'm having none of that. That is nonsensical. One day I'm going to hit somebody with that. One day. One day the big bloody sword will get someone. And I won't just rely on the straight sword, which I love. Pretty much this fume sword may just be the new transplant for future builds that I make that aren't cosplays. Which are very few and far between, by the way. For arms, son of the whatever the hell I called it. That's the only one that isn't actual strict cosplay that's something different. Nope, having none of that shit. What is that sword you're using, by the way? Legitimately curious. Finally got somebody with that. <laughs> I know this shouldn't be a prick. Like, me laughing there is kind of like arrogant. That's a good game. I'm trying to be less of a prick. Oh, it's a Havel monster. Looks like Raim is about to redeem himself in the eyes of Vendrick because no... Wow, we both just whiffed. Because nobody likes a Havel monster. Not even a Havel monster likes a Havel monster. Come here. I swear, if you were fat rolling like the last guy, I would, I would pummel your ass into the dirt. And I'd make you enjoy it, you goddamn bitch. Don't even think about it. I don't mind R1 spamming the shit out of you. Ow! You ruined my perfect, and now you R1 spammed me. You made me feel shitty. Go fuck yourself, you goddamn horsed up bitch. I promised myself I wouldn't get mad in this recording, but goddamn it. Havel monsters, that's all it takes. You're wearing gowers. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I'm having none of that shit. Get that in your face. That's gonna be very hard to hit people with, isn't it? I'm just gonna have to go for one of the- one of those that doesn't work. I'm beginning to think this two-handing malarkey wasn't worth it. Beginning to think it wasn't worth it at all. Nope, having none of it. What are you gonna go for? Go on! Oh, 
The fact you're wearing Gowl is going to fuck me over if I end up hitting you as you roll away from me as well. Because it's going to do reduced damage. You're a big bloody meanie. I told you. Got you. Oh, what the hell happened? What happened there? Like we bounced off of each other, but there was nothing that should have made that happen. Confusion. Confusion to the max. Have one of those. Oh, I just realised your ring's broken now. Will you stop going for a bloody chest? Sure. <laughs> That animation cutoff was perfect. Stop bloody gesturing. I don't know why, but that's annoying me. It's like every time you do something, you're just bloody gesturing. I would have loved to have backstabbed you now I broke your ring. Would have loved it. How the fuck am I alive? Thank God for guard break. Oh, guard break. Poise break. Oof, I'm having none of that. I see your pyro. I'm expecting combustion in my immediate future and potential demise. It's going to be on my goddamn gravestone. Oh, thank God for poise break again. Oof, I really don't like you. I love you, actually, because you oh, I take it back. You're a long-lost love. You're a heartbreaking bitch. Good game. Oh, hello. How are you doing up there, Mr. Katana user with a uh, weapon... Oh, not weapon. Armor I can't quite decipher. Bloody hell, why'd you go for a strong attack? You could have combat if you didn't go for that. What the hell are you going for, then? Confusion? D d what the... Oh. oh, I know what that is. I'm expecting a very fancy death in my future, and if you don't deliver, I'm going to be pissed. Don't even. If you beat me, it better be with a flashy move, because if it isn't, then you bloody disgraced yourself having that equipped. Huh? Ooh, damn it, I always expect the delay to catch people out, it never bloody works. That always does though. It's like the straight sword's so reliable, but I feel bad having doing it, having doing it, what the fuck, where did I learn English? Having done it, because it just, I don't know, it feels cheap and somewhat simple. I mean, look, he's got the goddamn Artorius blade with all that fancy flips and shit, and I'm just flailing my arm. I feel like I robbed the guy. And you. What the? Okay then, I'm convinced. What, what have I got to do? But what, what are you going for here? You're, you're, um, you're casting nothing. I, I don't know what was happening with you right there, but believe me when I say I'm very, very interested to know what the fuck was happening. Because you were... Okay, then, that should not have got you. I'm very interested to know what you were casting, or at least failing to cast, because you were just stood there with a limp, bloody staff, over... Ow! And over again, casting the same thing, with nothing happening. You're very concerning for me. Please! Holy shit, I finally got somebody with that. Oh, it's taken for fucking ever. It's so good to get a hit with that ultra-grade sword. I mean, I don't think... Is it ultra? Hang on, give me a moment, I'm not even sure if it is. It is an ultra. It's so hard to get people with that thing. I've fought you before, haven't I? Man, I said I was good with names, and yeah, I've somehow forgotten yours. Yours is rather unique. How do I forget that? How the fuck did you not get out of the way of any of that? Bloody hell. You can, you're concerning me, dude. I'm beginning to think... Oh. I say I'm beginning to think that the straight sword's a little bit too goddamn good. Walk toward me, would you? Oh, never mind. Oh, you, <laughs> you make me stagger. I'm going to get you with the follow-up attack. You've made me disgrace myself, pretty much. Please. Oh, oh, oh. I got a kill with the Ultra Great Sword. That's a first. That's a joyous moment. Now I actually feel like Rain. Oh, I remember you. I remember you all too well. And for all the wrong reasons. Go and walk into it. Oh, you disappointed me. I mean, you disappointed me by being waking up this morning because you're using bloody havels. There's something to be said about not taking a lot of damage by a big giant fireball. <laughs> Never mind what I was going to fucking say, Jesus. I could stop you from doing that, you realise? If you didn't... Uh, what well, didn't stagger you? That was a strong attack. And that was a weak attack. You've got to be kidding me with this off and off nonsense. What are you going for? <laughs> you... <laughs> you just... <laughs> Did we all just see that? Did we? Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I just saw him trying to cast... Three times, th 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 buffing his weapon. <laughs> he died trying to cast a buff. How are you doing? What are you using? Is that the... No, oh, it's watchers. I didn't mean to go for that. I'm very, very sorry. Our first bloody interaction with me going for a backstab. Complete accident. Happens all the time, I promise you. Are you going to um do anything? Oh, you went for a parry there, I think. Oh, you did again. Interesting. Very... Oh, God damn it! What is that you're using, by the way? I think it's a dagger. What is it? Could be the Royal Dirk. It's hard to tell when it's bloody buzzing all over the bloody place. <laughs> Gotta have to wait for the buff to bloody run out so I can actually figure out what it is. Nice attempted parry there. Are you wearing Hex's... Oh, that was an accident. I am very, very sorry. I was about to ask, are you wearing Hex's hood? Because it kind of looks like it, but I'm very likely wrong. You know, being phantomized kind of makes things hard to bloody identify. That was a poor idea to spam. Really was. Oh, almost got you. And... Oh! 
Oh! <laughs> you were just on the border of the damage there. That sucks for you. I would apologise, but there was absolutely nothing shitty about that victory, to be perfectly honest with you. Good game. Okay then, Mr. Lightning Katana, with your- Oh wait, hang on. It's not just Mr. Lightning Katana, it's Sir Alon, and he's being slightly disgraced with a whip. That's not me saying whips are the devil, and whips should not be used, but Sir Alon did not use a goddamn whip, bitch. Don't fucking sully his name with mismatched equipment, with your very odd facing away from me yet still hitting me. What is that? You know of it. Well then again, I talk about disgracing people. I'm the bloody goddamn fume knight, and I'm barely even using the ultra bloom blade. Ultra Bloom Blade. Ultra Fume Blade, and it's Fume Ultra Blade as well. Not even the right name, and I got it wrong even fucking worse the first time. Got you through your all. You can be invisible. Ow. Well, that's a failure. Not so you can be invisible all you goddamn want through your rolls. It's not gonna make me miss. That's really bad for me. You know, I don't really like you, but I just. Oh, you cheeky bent. Please. I feel shitty having hit you every single time with nothing but an R1 from a straight sort. But you were a challenging bastard, so I didn't do it out of cheapness, but more out of necessity to win. <laughs> Very sorry. Oh! I'm fighting a real. Well, actually, I was about to say I'm fighting a real Sir Alon, and I'm not. You're not even wearing the goddamn armor. Sorry. I feel shitty every time somebody sees me backstab as my first fucking at. It's so annoying to me that that's my first interaction in the fight. It ri- Ooh, that's not a good damage trade-off. It's only slightly- Ow! Worth it because you were already pre-damaged in order to do the extra damage. There we go, now it's getting slightly- No, it's not getting worth it. That attack is so swift that I can stop it like maybe a half second before it's gone off and it'll still bloody hit me. Please, Jesus! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, thank God you did that, you silly billy! I don't know why you did, you could have fucking ended me just by blinking there, but instead you hesitated and did a wind-up odd attack. I don't know if you went for a guard break by accident or what the fuck that was, I've never even seen it before. But safe to say, you ballsed up. And thanks to that, I won. <laughs> People that attack, it really is. Good, good. <coughs> oh, okay. Rapiers are now a freight train. You can't stop that ship going through the station, it just plows on right through. I mean, you're allowed to do whatever you want, but good god, man. You're constantly running away from me! Get your dick out of your purse and fucking fight! Oh, that was a mistake. That was a very big- what the- What the- why was I staggered for three hits? Ugh! You're a prick! Oh. <laughs> and that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, then don't forget to leave a like to broadcast the fact that you'd like to see more from this specific series. And if you enjoyed it to the point where you'd actually want to see more from this series, or this channel in general, then don't forget to share this video with your friends and subscribe so you don't miss out on any future installments. And should the sub boxes be failing you, as they do for most, then feel free to bookmark my video page and check back daily, as that's how often I provide content to you. Or alternatively, you could follow me on any respective social media service you should desire as I update them all regularly with my videos as this site isn't actually known to be good at doing its job. So, as always, your viewership and YouTube support will always be infinitely appreciated. And assuming you do indeed want to see more from me and the content I provide, then I will see you in the next video.